Hi everyone, I hope you're well. This is Coins Kid. I'm just going to dive into Bitcoin once again. Thank you for support. Okay, big up the Coins Kid crew. Thank you to each and every single one of you for everything that you do. Honestly, thank you. I wish I could meet you in the street and buy you a beer. Okay, but hopefully we'll have a big beach party when we've all sold and gone to the beach and we'll all just get smashed one day and do surfing and all that kind of business here yeah, and have a laugh and put some tunes on. Yes, it, hopefully, you know, we get this continuation. It's, it's looking geared up. You know, there is always, always the possibility of a correction. You, you're fully aware of it. I've taught you that in the space right now. There's always the possibility of a correction. You know, these things come. And if I do, as long as you're holding key level support, you, you're fantastic for continuation. So straight off the bat, without doing any technicals or lines or anything like that, your key level support for me in this bull market is this red line. Okay, I want, I want to see that back test at some point. It doesn't mean it has to happen. But if you do start to roll, this is an area that's of keen interest to me. And I'll definitely put some bids on there at five six four seven three okay straight off the bat i'll keep reminding you because a roll will come and when it comes you'll be like oh no where's the support for me you're 55 ema and obviously if you start to roll and lose that you've got your swing high which will hold a support but i don't necessarily think you're going to come all the way down there right now i could be wrong but given the, the previous structure of the previous bull run you know when we start to go parabolic here because this is what we're looking to do we're looking to put in this parabolic many mania stage right, that we did here okay this is the leg that we're looking for and i do believe it's coming okay there's a lot of sort of technical analysis and and, and sort of confluence of the fact that this this is coming for us for bitcoin so if it does come you know look at the waveforms you come up there in november overextended bit of a sell-off double top rolled over 55 ema bounce beautiful retest and at that point imagine that in a couple of days one two three four days no we're going to zero the bears are correct we're going to zero and we bounce off the 55 look at that opportunity okay from that 55 because from that 55 bitcoin actually went on a whopping 246 percent in a bull market within a couple of months and it had that blow off top in december now this is you know i'm not saying it will happen but but always have it on your radar if you do start to see a roll okay if there was a roll in the markets here my technical primary level of support well i would put some cheeky bids on without being too clever is the 55 ema on the daily because i do think it'll hold so right now bitcoin is breaking out okay so you are in technical targets to the upside i'm going to show you those you've got two patterns here you've got an ascending triangle which you've broken out of okay we've been keeping an eye on this right now that technical target is six nine one one six okay so you're actually in a technical target to that but obviously you run into resistance and not only that you've got this whopping horizontal that you've come up into so you've got a technical target for that as well so you know you're in two technical targets basically to the upside one is that there at 72731 so obviously you've got to come up meet the resistance roll back for support coil up like you did here you know potentially that's what you're doing right now you're coming up you're coiling up potent potentially some kind of horizontal we'll have a look in a moment on a on a you know a lower time frame but just there you can see these are technical targets and equally if you start to come up now and break this local high well i'll say the local high is the all-time wick high just there at 6707 seven if you start to break that you're on that white line which is seven four five seven two with the potential for a little bit of overextension as well you might get a little bit of extension on that particular one six one eight target so you know the, the the way you're in that technical target to the one six one eight is when you break this high which you've not quite broke yet okay but you are breaking out of bullish uh, patterns bullish continuation patterns basically you've got an ascending triangle you've got a, a huge horizontal i think in here you've got a inverse head and shoulders in there as well you know which you've broken as well if i can show it to you left shoulder head and that's your right shoulder just there and you come up to the neckline you've broken out already so it's all bullish you know but it doesn't mean that you can't run into a resistance and roll back so right now you've got technical support that you need to hold because if you do start to lose that support like i said to you here in this apex if you was to lose this technical support then that would be a precursor to rolling down and coming down to the 55 and if you start to lose that you're going to bounce off the swing high but you can see how close it came to the apex and like i said to you you know you come into the apex some kind of break will happen here for bitcoin and it did okay is it off to the races could be but it needs to break this high it's got some work to do okay so don't get overly excited we are in technical targets to the upside but if you remember we was in technical targets to the downside and we put in this little fake out and come back into the pattern do you remember that head and shoulders that everyone got really excited about that that head and shoulders pattern there we had a technical breakdown to 54k i think it was and it never came did it it was just a little fake out basically so is this a little fake out you know are we sort of caught in a range before we do get the before we do get the breakout you know the, the breakout for bitcoin it's bullish the market's bullish we've got certain altcoins that are breaking out key levels of resistance so there's a lot of confluence to the fact that this could be it this could be the break that we're looking for okay so are all eyes on bitcoin basically so yeah you're looking really really good you are looking good and one thing i want to point out is you know since we broke out down here since this low for bitcoin we have moved impulsively beautifully 
impulsively as well because look we had this high okay then we rolled over and put the low and from there you started to come up and break that high so it was an impulsive wave and like i said to you this whole journey i says look you're going to come up to 51170 roughly around there wasn't it and look at that 1618 met like a boss we traced for a key level of support and then you put in a new impulsive wave and from there that new impulsive wave was from there to there and you can see when you started to retrace and come back up and broke that high that you put in before you started to retrace you had a new impulsive wave target which 1618 and you can see you ran into it like a boss little bit of a bull trap there wick high roll back to a key level support and right now you're putting a new impulsive wave but like i said to you the greater you retrace the greater the impulsive pace so right now if we do actually go on to the next impulsive wave target it's only that white line okay that's where you're going to get to off the 1618 so what we do need to do here if you want to see this continuation and we need to get up to this 108 is we do not need to start going a bit parabolic here to get up to this line by the end of november isn't it which is i think plan b's technical target is 98k which is roughly round about there so that's what we're looking to get to by the end of november to sort of you know continue with plan b's projections basically so yeah watch this space watch this space with this impulsive wave which we're breaking right now technical target seven four six two eight roughly around the area if we do start to break that then you could actually start to go a little bit parabolic here for, for bitcoin before putting in a larger retracement for the continuation but this this it happens look you come up look at that that was a that was a whopping as you come up there that was a whopping 40 40 percent correction and just here as well we put in a bit of a correction on the uh, weekly time frame just there we come up got really overextended and from there we came all the way back down didn't we and that was a 90 uh, 30 percent i'm not gonna say 90 percent 30 percent retracement before we got the continuation of blow off top you know th this is what's coming in my opinion again not got a crystal ball there's no guarantees but that we're looking for this sort of mania phase right now for, for crypto and bitcoin especially so when it starts to go up you know it starts to melt faces and takes off into space and it it basically becomes unchartable other than zooming out and using fibs you know for price discovery basically because that's what we are we're in price discovery right now this is why you have to use fibs so you enjoyed that update and hope you understand what i'm saying as well you know and apologies for the the lateness of the video today i've been all over the place um take care everyone back soon with an update on bitcoin stay healthy stay strong stay tuned Bye bye